Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So I'm in my car and I'm getting ready to head to Big Lots because I've seen that they have Christmas decor out and I'm ready for it. I know that it's not even Halloween, but if you don't get there early and get some of the stuff that they have, you're gonna miss out. I know, I've been there. So I'm trying to get there early this year and I wanted to show you guys what they have. So I'm gonna take you guys along and check out their Christmas decor. I'm really excited. Got my Christmassy sweater on. It's finally getting chilly here in North Carolina, so I thought, why not? Let's just get in that Christmas spirit and get going to Big Lots and see what they have. If you're new to my channel, I'm Callie, and I do a lot of home decor tours, some cleaning, some lifestyle, basically anything to do with your home and making a house a home I'm all about, and that's what my channel is about. So definitely subscribe if you like those kinds of things. I would love to have you. And give this video a thumbs up if you like these kinds of videos. I do plan on doing a few more Christmas shop with me's for the year, so stay tuned for that. And I would be doing a ton of Christmas decor stuff. I'm so excited. I know everyone's excited for Christmas because 2020 has just been crazy. So everyone is just looking forward to Christmas for a little bit of normalcy. I get it. So without further ado, let's get this car rolling and let's head on to Big Lots. All right, so this was the first style I went down. It really caught my eye because it was more of your traditional Christmas colors. That Christmas tree farm tray definitely came home with me. I fell in love with that. They had a ton of decorative candles and wax warmers, a ton of like decorative night lights. Also, if you have a black lab or a black dog, I would definitely check out Big Lots because they had so many cute decorative things with a black lab on it. And if you want to decorate with your pup in mind, I would definitely check them out. They also had a bunch of little trucks, which I thought was really cute. And this Jingle Bell table runner was so precious. Also, if you think I'm going a little bit too fast, you can always pause it. I do that when I'm watching these videos just to kind of get a better overview of what I'm looking at. Also, it's really hard to film these when you're in an aisle and someone else is walking up behind you trying to look at something. So again, if you think I'm going too fast, just pause it and you can get a better look at everything I'm looking at. They had a ton of decorative plates and trays. I thought those were really pretty with the truck on them. And then they had a bunch of mugs and like tumblers for wine. Also, I just want to mention that I did think that Big Lots was a little bit overpriced in some of their stuff. But if you sign up for their rewards program, you get 15% off your entire first purchase. So if you see any of this stuff that catches your eye, I would definitely sign up for that. If you're already signed up, just get yourself another email and sign up through that because they had a ton of cute stuff and 15% off is awesome. I loved this little tray and the Lazy Susan to match. They also just had really cute chargers and plates and again, this is probably my favorite aisle out of all of them. I love that they were all like separated by your different themes. And again, I gravitated towards this one because I'm super traditional when it comes to Christmas colors. I love the just reds and greens and golds and silvers. Those are my absolute favorite. So I'm just gonna kind of let the music run and then I'll pop back in when something catches my eye because I don't want to talk the entire time, but they had a lot of really cute stuff. The one thing I did really like at Big Lots was they had a lot of really cute soap dispensers for Christmas. I bought this one for my powder room. It was $8. I thought it was really sweet. They had a lot of decorative towels and I actually really loved their shower curtains. I thought the curtains with the decorative hooks were really cute. 
Um, this red door with the wreath was really pretty. And they just had a lot of really cute festive stuff in this aisle. I also really love this little window pane with the wreath and the joy and the holly berries. Oh, this aisle was my absolute favorite. And I just loved everything they had down this aisle. It was so stinking cute. So this tablecloth really called to me. I wish I had a round table to put it on. It was so pretty. It was like watercolored and it was just super retro and had the barn and the snow and I loved it, but I don't have a round table to put it on. I wish I did, but they had a ton of tablecloths and placemats and this is where I found their really, really, really cute hand towels. I love these colors. They're just so pretty and just super traditional, which I love. thought this Santa Claus was really cute. I absolutely adored this lantern, but I feel like for $30, you could probably make something similar for cheaper, to be honest. But I did think they were really cute with the bottle brush trees and the candle inside and they lit up. I thought they were really pretty, but I definitely think you can make this for cheaper than $30, especially if you already have a lantern and they just had a lot of really cute light up stuff, which I thought was great. But again, it was just a little bit overpriced, but with a coupon, you never know. You could really rack up some good stuff. Not only green when summer's here, but also when it's cold and drear. Oh, Christmas tree. Christmas tree, thy leaves are so unchanging. Oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree, such pleasure do you bring me. Oh, so I really loved this wreath with the trucks and pine cones and berries. I thought that was super adorable. And then they had a lot of stockings and tree skirts. And then I'm going to move over into the ornaments, which they had a lot of really great ornaments. I'm not going to lie. Like, I mean, you could have found a theme and went with it and gotten everything you needed here at Big Lots. I mean, it was awesome. I loved their ornaments. They had a lot of really cute, like, ribbon and garland and um, 
just really, really cute ornaments. I really was impressed with their ornament selection. Okay, so these were by far my favorite ornaments that I saw. I thought these were so pretty. I love them. I love that they had like the, it looked like a snow globe, which I really loved. And then they have a few more down here. I also love that they had ornaments for like a kid's tree. I have two daughters. Um, my oldest is almost four and my youngest is six months. So I thought these would be really cute. Maybe not the glass ones, but they had these, which I thought were really pretty with the pinks and purples and golds. And they had ornaments for every theme and they weren't super expensive. So I would check out Big Lots because they had a ton and I really, really liked their ornament selection. So this next aisle, they had poinsettias, they had tabletop decor, they had wreaths, which I might go back and get this wreath up here, right there with the berries on it for a project I'm gonna be working on. I mean, they had garland, they had just a ton of really pretty wreaths and um, everything that you could ever imagine for your glittery heart, they had it down this aisle, which I loved. So I might have to go back and get this countdown to Christmas. I think that that's really pretty. Um, but this aisle was just a lots of like glitz and um, glitter and just really rich colors, which I love. Um, and then again, they hit it out of the park with their soap dispensers. They had so many to choose from. I fell in love. I'm going to have to go back and get some of those too. I need one for my kitchen, I've decided. So I'm going to go back and get that. And then after this aisle, I moseyed down the more of glam Christmas aisle, which I'll show you here in a second if that's your thing. But again, they just had really rich colors, which I loved. Okay, so this would definitely be the more glam aisle they had it labeled as a polar frost section which i totally agree with for me i called it more of a glam but um it was really pretty blues and whites and silvers and they had some really pretty accents with some eucalyptus and there's a doormat down here somewhere that i thought was really really pretty down here i think this is gorgeous they also had a little arched window mirror 
with a pretty wreath on it that I thought was gorgeous as well. But again, if glam or polar frost is your style, then this aisle was definitely for you. They had an aisle for pretty much everyone's decorating style, which I really appreciated. So then moving on to the artificial trees, they had some really pretty trees for your front porch. I loved this light post. I thought it was so pretty, but for $130, I'm just not sure. But with the 15% off coupon, you might could come out doing pretty good. But again, they just had these really pretty trees in these pretty boxes, which I loved. This would be so pretty on your front porch, just in front of your door. They had flocked trees, they had trees with colored lights and non-colored lights. I mean, they had a tree for everybody. They had a pretty pink tree um, that would go good in a little girl's room or a playroom. I mean, they pretty much had a tree for everybody, which I loved. And then they had a lot of really cute lawn ornaments as well. Lots of lampposts and deer and cute little greeneries and nutcrackers and that kind of thing. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I had so much fun shopping around with Big Lots and bringing you guys along. If you are new, don't forget to subscribe. I would love to have you and give this video a big thumbs up. And I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye. Christmas tree, thy leaves are so un-